Good morning, what are we gonna do today? Today we are gonna use quick cure clay and I'm using my new IOD molds and this one is called Boughs of Holly. And we made this little pot here and then we also made this bigger one that I'm gonna show you and we colored it in, but it's just so cute and it's it dries very, very hard so you can use it to put fun things in, but let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna start with our molds and I am gonna be making this bowl over this glass piece. What you wanna really make sure of is the bottom of whatever you're doing is smaller than the top because when you try to lift it, you have to be able to get it out. This is the Boughs of Holly new IOD mold. I am just gonna put some cornstarch in these and I am really just gonna be using the evergreens and the pine cones. I'm gonna put just a little cornstarch on this. I don't think it will stick to this glass. It will pop off. But I'm just gonna put a little on there. And I'm gonna be using my Quick Cure Clay. And we've done a couple other videos using this. It does have an odor, so you wanna use a, a ventilated area. But after you do cure it, the smell goes away. Roll it up in your hands a little bit. And I do notice it's a, it's a little stickier than regular air dried clay. One thing nice about this clay is it doesn't dry out. Until you cure it, it stays soft. So I'm gonna do several of the big ones, several of the small ones, and just have them done, and then I can start putting them around my bowl. And since it doesn't dry out, if I don't use those pieces, I can just put it back in my container and use it for something else. So I just rolled out a little piece to put over the top, and it doesn't need to be perfect, just so that it's flat on the top, and I am just going to start putting some of these pieces here and overlapping and So I'm gonna use my heat gun and we are going to cure this. I'm just gonna put a coat of this kind of light white gray paint, just whatever color you would like. Okay, I'm just gonna do a wash, and I just took some brown paint and watered it down some, and then I'm gonna wipe some of it out. Looks really dark right now, but it won't when we're done. Just do the inside and then wipe it out really quick. And the inside's smooth, so there's not like gonna be a whole lot of ridges and things for it to go into. Because it's so watered down, it goes into everything really nicely. So let's see if I can get this to dry a little bit and then we'll move on. So I'm just gonna wax this now. Okay, so I am just gonna take some of my chalks and just lightly brush some green onto this greenery. I'm just putting a clear, just a real light coat of clear wax over all of this. And I went over the green first and then took another piece of my 
towel and then I'm going over the pine cones because you can see there's green on that. Now all I'm doing is just adding a little bit of gold wax to these pine cones. Do a light buff on these. And then I'm just gonna put one more sealer over the top. So after watching this, I hope you didn't think it was too hard. It really isn't after you get the gist of using your heat gun and the clay. But this just turned out, I think, really cute. But remember, you can use any mold. You could do any all different colors for whatever occasion you're doing. But I hope you have fun.